subscribe and then turn the notification on to get notified about every new lesson which I upload in this channel every day. Merhaba arkadaşlar, welcome back. In today's lesson we will learn conversations about sport. In this video we will learn some useful sentences which is about football. This is language animated channel and I'm gonna start the lesson now. So take your notebook and pen and sit down and relax and enjoy learning Turkish. For example, when you want to ask do you like football? In Turkish you will say like this. Football sever misiniz? Football sever misiniz? Football sever misiniz? It means do you like football? Football means football. Sever misiniz? Means do you like or do you love? This is formal. And to make this sentence informal, just change from misiniz to misin. And it becomes informal sentence. And the meaning is same. Football sever misiniz? Do you like football? Now, you answer like this, which is easy. Evet, seviyorum. Evet, seviyorum. Evet, seviyorum. It means, yes, I like, or yes, I love. Seviyorum also means, I love. You can use it for both. Or you can say hayır sevmiyorum. Hayır sevmiyorum. It means no, I don't like or I don't love. Maybe some of you has allergy with running so he or she will not like football. So stay safe, otherwise running is an amazing exercise. Now when you want to say what do you support? You are asking about the team in football, right? So in Turkish you will ask like this. Kimi tutuyorsunuz? Kimi tutuyorsunuz? Kimi tutuyorsunuz? It means what do you support? Kimi means who? Tutuyorsunuz means you catch or you take. But it also means support. This is formal. To make this informal, just change from tutuyorsunuz to tutuyorsun. Okay? Now you can say who do you support. To say this in Turkish, you can say like this. İ tutuyorum. İ tutuyorum. Now you can see it's weird. But don't worry. Look. First you will say the name of the team which you support. And then you will add İ at the end. And then you say tutuyorum. So it means I support and the name of the team. Okay? Don't worry. If you support any of football team and you couldn't make the sentence, then you can comment me and ask me and I will make that sentence for you. And I always reply you guys very fast. Faster than your 3G internet. Okay? Now if you have a favorite player and you want to ask this in Turkish, you can ask like this. En sevdiğiniz oyuncu kim? En sevdiğiniz oyuncu kim? En sevdiğiniz oyuncu kim? It means who is your favorite player? En means the most. Sevdiğiniz means which you love or like. Oyuncu means player. And kim means who is. This is formal. To make this informal, you just need to change sevdiğin is to sevdiğin. And the meaning will be same. And you can name your favorite player like this. En sevdiğim oyuncu. And the name of the player. En Sevdiğim oyuncu 
and the name of the player. En sevdiğim oyuncu and the name of the player. Okay? So here you can see N means the most. Sevdiğim means which I like. And oyuncu means player. And if you want to say more good things about the player, you can say like this. O müthiş bir oyuncu. O müthiş bir oyuncu. O müthiş bir oyuncu. It means he or she is a great player. O means he or she or also it. Muthish means terrific, stunning, great. Bir means one. Oyuncu means player. So o muthish bir oyuncu means he or she is a great player, stunning player. And the last sentence is, the coach is, and the name of the coach. In Turkish you will say, antrenör, and the name of the coach. Antrenör, and the name of the coach. It means, the coach is, and the name. Okay? So, this video became too long. I hope you are not angry to me. If you are angry, then drink some cold water. And take some deep breath and try to relax without punching me on my face. Because if you punch me on my face, then my face will become ugly and my eyes will not be able to see for some days. And then I will not be able to make videos. So don't be angry and don't punch me. Okay? If you enjoyed the lesson, then please like this video because it will motivate me to make more Turkish lessons. But... If you don't like it, then I will think that you don't want to learn Turkish anymore. Then I maybe stop making Turkish lessons, okay? And share with others. And subscribe to Language Animated Channel for more Turkish lessons like this, because they are all free. And subscribing is also free. Don't worry. Thanks for watching. And güle güle.